Portraying the Lives of Everyday Women a travelling exhibition of visual and performing arts on women and peace building in Sri Lanka brought together art and theatre performances by exceptionally talented artists from across the country. The exhibition, Searching for an Elusive Peace, Women in Times of Transition, took on a unique approach to highlight significant social issues faced by women in the post-war context. Walking into the JDA Pereira Gallery in Colombo on the 8th of December 2015, the exhibition, organized by Focus Women, would instantaneously absorb you into the art and sculptures of eight artisans coming from different walks of life. As they showcased some of their best work, for some, it was their first time. Curated by Sanjeeva Kumara, a surreal and fantasy artist from Sri Lanka, this portion of the exhibition radiated a vibrant composure to the room. Experience. The second component of the exhibition comprised of theatre performances which brought to light certain issues and challenges endured by women in the country. The plays focused on conflict-affected women who are in positions of isolation and difficulty due to language, disability, domestic violence, the loss of a husband or patriarchal norms that have been instilled in society for centuries. Directed by playwright and actress Kaushalya Fernando, every production was crafted to send out a strong message that led to a lively discussion moderated by editor of Ground Views, Sanjana Hattotua. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
பந்த காரணாவ என்னலவே லச்சாயிட்டுமா அப்ப இவனுக்கு தான் பிரச்சன ஆல தீரும் ஒரே பாட்ச் சீங்க சீங்கலங்க வந்து தேரி பண்ணற அடிக்காது மீட் அட வகிட்ட தேரி கமீதலி யாரோட சீங்கலங்க பண்ணற அடிக்காது ஆ மீ வந்துகா மீ மீ மண்டவே தேரி என்ன மீ மீ ஆகி பட்டில வந்து The three decade long conflict had a devastating impact on many due to the loss of lives, displacement, and the constant fear that engulfed us all. However, many of us have ceased to remember those who were at the center of hostilities and how they continue to live their lives now that the war has come to an end. This next play may not do justice, but it does give us an insight into the life after war of a female ex-combatant. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. No, my goodness, I'm really sorry. 
the number of female heads of households have increased over the years, particularly among widows who have had to take on the responsibility of their family. This next play addresses several pertinent issues surrounding female-headed households, one of which is the right to land that widows are grappling with due to the lack of sufficient knowledge about the law among authorities and the discriminatory practices within the system. Traveling exhibition, Focus Women takes us on a journey into the lives of women who are experiencing harsh realities as a result of war. It's rarely brought to our attention that there are many 
especially women, who are still affected and seeking redress in ways they know how. Thus performances such as these gives us a moment to reflect on the lives they lead, to realize that there are brave women among us who are vigorously moving forward despite the constant and unjustifiable setbacks in their lives. Thank you.